hey now, and how are you doing? You come here often? I think I've seen you around before. You have a twin? I swear I've seen somebody who looks just like you, but you know, not as good looking. I like that outfit you're wearing, but... I don't know, you look so official and serious, you probably don't want to talk to a guy like me. Yeah, I can't. I can't pull that off anymore. I don't know what I was thinking. Come home, see a FedEx box on the porch, and I immediately started thinking, all right, what kind of goofy ridiculousness can I start this video with? What's up, everybody? I'm Noah from PhoneDog.com, and inside the box, it's a pre. No, it's not a pre, but it is the new Palm packaging. Saw this at Mobile World Congress. This crazy new Palm packaging, the rectangle with the little uh, angular cutout thing there. We saw it, uh, I saw it at Mobile World Congress in the pre-box, but this is the Trio Pro. The new Palm device for Sprint, Windows Mobile 6.1. Just got it in the mail. Thanks so much to the folks at Sprint and Palm for sending it over. Baby, it's all right. You know, everybody's all excited by the new younger model, but I think you, uh, you old models have a refinement about you. You know what I'm saying? You age well over time. You're looking good. Yeah, that's it. I'm done trying to use pickup lines on a cell phone. I never had any pickup lines anyway. Trust me. Inside the box. Oh, dear. Happy Friday. Ooh, I like the orange, though. I mean, that's it. Uh, I like the phone. I'm a sucker for orange. This fancy new packaging from Palm. I'll tell you what. Here's the Trio Pro. We'll get to that in a second. Inside the box, you get... Uh, oh, I broke it. You get this orange... Thing, this orange uh, packing material, which game over. That's all you need, in my opinion. You also get uh, this nice little plastic sleeve. Getting started. Oh, the, even the manuals are dog eared for you and wrapped up in orange. I'll tell you what, Palm stepping up their game. Press conference at CES, they had cocktails here, inspired, and, inspired by and designed in California. I'm not saying that sounds like Apple, I'm just saying. But, uh, you know, definitely snazzier packaging than the, uh, the last Palm device I reviewed. Here's your USB cable. Here is your charging plug. No, it's not a touchstone. It's not wireless charging. But it is uh, a cylinder. <laughs> Some orange corrugated paper. Certificate of Authenticity. Subscriber agreement, everything's dog-eared now. Maybe that's their style. And uh, limited warranty. And the box, the inside of the box is orange. I'm going to keep this box and use it for something else, I think. Here's the phone. Uh, Windows Mobile. Sprint 3G. It's nice. The form factor is nice. A little more rounded. Uh, it's got the little tiny palm keyboard buttons, which, you know, kind of are a little bit love-hate, depending on uh, who you are. Uh, on the top, we've got a power switch, which I will press right now. See if we have any juice in here. We do. It just vibrated. Here it comes. Uh, there's a mute switch, a little uh, toggle switch. On the back, there's your camera, no flash, a little speaker grill. On this side, looks like a voice command button, and uh, this is not a button. Maybe this is an IR port. On the other side, a rocker switch and a shortcut key. Starting up there. On the bottom, USB jack, and that looks like it might be a three and a half millimeter headphone jack. That'd be kind of exciting. I don't see any specs on the box. I did just spill everything else out onto the floor. Oh, here's some specs. It just tells you what you get, though. So, I don't know. Phone's starting up. I have seven new voice messages. Interesting. They know where I am. Oh, it's you know what it is. It's the phone calling me back because my pickup lines were so good. I didn't even have to. She Googled me. The phone Googled me to find out how to get in touch with me because I was such a sweet talker. So we've got Wi-Fi going on the phone. Uh, Windows Mobile, like we said, it's a touch screen. Uh, I'm not seeing a stylus. Oh, yeah, I am. There we go. Here's your stylus slot. It's just so, baby, your curves are so sexy. I didn't even see the stylus. Uh, it's not a telescoping stylus, just a regular stylus. Uh, let's do the quick tour. Then on the front, you've got you know two shortcut buttons: your Windows Mobile Start button, calendar shortcut. Uh, you know standard buttons. You've got your uh, your D-pad here. It doesn't seem to be a touch sensor thing like Samsung's been doing. Just straight up D-pad, but circular with select button in the middle, and then your little keyboard. Yeah, let's give me the tour. 
You guys want to you guys want to take the tour? It's a five-way navigator. See, it's doing my job for me. Thanks, Palm and Sprint. Center access is the highlighted item. So there you go. All right, let's try out the keyboard real quick, and then uh, and then you know the phone will blow me off. It's going to go home. I'm going home alone tonight. Apparently, um, I do not know where this metaphor came from with me trying to hit on the cell phone. It's just this is what happens when you do all these videos. You you make up some weird stuff sometimes. But we'll try out the keyboard. That's what I want to know. Baby, I bet I could push your buttons if I tried hard enough. There you go. Yeah. The quick. So the thing with these kinds of keys, I don't think I can tell you this while I'm typing. Lazy sheep dog. Not bad. The thing with these kinds of keys that I always find is with these smaller QWERTY keyboards, I always try to push with like my thumbnail or the very tip of my thumb. And actually they're designed, you know, they're, they're rounded and they're spaced well enough that they're designed just to be typed on. So I'm trying to do this and like my thumbs hurt and I'm going to get repetitive stress in this odd place and I'll go to the doctor and it'll be like, nobody gets RSS there. What's wrong with your thumb tendon? You know, I'm trying to do this. Really, if I just, just type on it straight, you know, straight on, um, with the pad of my thumb like I'm supposed to, it actually works just fine. Except, I seem to have an issue typing the word over. Now why is that? I guess when I'm going down to press the V, you can see both times that there's space between the V and the E, the V and the E. I guess I went down and kind of hit both the V and the space bar. So interesting. Uh, but there you go. It's Evdu. It is uh, Wi-Fi. Uh, it's got, you know, it's Windows Mobile, but they did a little bit of, uh, looks like a little bit of tweaking here to the uh, menu system. Not quite, you know, TouchFlow 3D kind of thing, but a little bit of, little bit of stuff. Uh, Internet Explorer on there. We'll see if we can get, let's see if I can get Spy, Skyfire on here. Chat Skyfire on it. Um, it's a, uh, looks like it's a resistive touchscreen, not capacitive. But, you know, it feels pretty good. The form factor of the phone's nice. Nice and small, nice and light. Feels pretty solid. The glossy plastic, the rounded curves. You know, all right. Palm, getting back in it. It's the Palm Trio Pro from Sprint. I am your, uh... <laughs> oh, it's been a long week. It's been raining a lot here. What can I tell you? I'm a little goofy. I'm your host, Noah from PhoneDog.com. You don't really need to... There I am. You see me in the reflection? That's me. Hey, baby. How you doing? And uh, it's the Palm Trio... Palm Trio Pro from Sprint, Windows Mobile 6.1. We'll have a lot more on this phone on PhoneDog.com. I will also test it, and I'll be back with a full video review for you. And, uh, you know, it's hard to see Palm and not think pre right now. But uh, Trio Pro for all you Windows Mobile users, definitely, you know, first glance looks worth a look. I like the form factor. All right? We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Yeah, I know. I'm going home alone. I know.